It's definitely creating a greater awareness of the problems surrounding education. Welcome to Free Colorado News, this is Ari Armstrong. In this episode I interview Ben DeGroo of the Independence Institute on Education Issues. There's lots of things going on in Colorado related to the teachers unions. One of the things we're promoting uh, of late is the fact you know, that every year around this time teachers unions have these opt-out windows where if you're a member of the union you, you can opt in any time but like the Hotel California it's really kind of hard to get out. So a lot of the contracts will say you can only opt out between September 1st and September 15th. So one of the things we've been doing is advertising to teachers this option and letting them know that uh, that's available and uh, promoting the fact that this should be on a level playing field and teachers should have the same opportunity to get in or out of the union or choose any organization they want or don't want to belong to. Basic basic concept of liberty. And uh, we, have, we have a great video up on our webpage about a teacher telling this story, how she, um, due to family medical emergencies, had a hard time getting out of the union. It cost her a lot of money. So What's the webpage offhand? Education. .i2i.org. Um, have you seen the two, I guess there's two documentaries out recently about charter schools and education. Have you seen those yet? Uh, they're actually quite, there's a series of education reform films that came out this year. The first one was The Cartel, mm -hmm. which we, we hosted an event in the spring, which is about New Jersey particularly, and uh, the, the corruption and the abuse of power by unions and district officials. Uh, and then in the summertime, the movie The Lottery came out very specifically about uh, poorer kids in Harlem whose you know, educational futures and possibly their lives are staked on winning a lottery to get into a charter school. And uh, the new movie that's coming out that I haven't seen yet is Waiting for Superman, which is interestingly directed by the same guy who gave us <laughs> Al Gore's An Inconvenient Truth, uh, but really is, with his massive uh, marketing budgets, really exposed a lot of the problems with education and created a lot of debate. So do you see that, have you seen in your work that spurring more positive public discussion about some of these problems? Yeah, it has, and, and, and it's definitely creating a greater awareness of the problems surrounding education. The problem is whether it'll create the political will for um, policymakers to actually implement real, lasting solutions. Um, things that begin, begin with parental choice and, and school vouchers and uh, true market-based accountability and things like that rather than the, the same old status quo. Check out my book about Harry Potter's heroic fight for values at valuesofharrypotter.com.